CEO Dave Kowloon has called for a ban on Megan, speaking at the Invictus closing ceremony, threatening to withdraw Boeing's sponsorship. A spokesperson has confirmed that Megan and Harry will be attending the Invictus Games 2023 in Dusseldorf this month, with Harry present from the start and Megan joining later in the competition. Both are scheduled to be at the closing ceremony. However, the controversy arose when Boeing CEO David Calhoun warned of possibly ending Boeing's sponsorship for this year's event. This announcement came one day after Megan's attendance had been reported. Dave has vocally expressed his desire to prohibit Megan from speaking at any part of the event. In April, Boeing had initially announced its expanded support for the Invictus Games, becoming the presenting partner for Invictus Games Dusseldorf 2023. This move was hailed for its significant contribution to the rehabilitation of wounded servicemen and women worldwide. Nevertheless, Boeing is now distancing itself from Invictus Games due to Meghan Markle's involvement. Notably, Disney, another major sponsor of the event, had invested heavily in Invictus Games in the past. However, with news of Meghan's appearance in the closing ceremony, Disney CEO Bob Eager is not someone they want to upset, especially in the realm of show business. A reference was made to an incident at the Lion King premiere, where Harry pitched Meghan to Bob Eager, which apparently didn't sit well with Eager's wife. Critics argue that Meghan and Harry, who are reportedly earning millions for an Invictus documentary, have failed to put in the effort required. Their focus seems to be on personal appearances, merchandise, and luxury travel, rather than genuinely engaging with the veterans who have endured so much. There is an awareness of the negative sentiment towards Meghan's involvement, with concerns of potential booing, and a high number of negative comments on Invictus websites. The situation has raised questions about Meghan's true motivations, with some suggesting that she prioritizes publicity and branding over the veterans' experiences. There's a perception that Meghan seeks to maintain a high profile, especially around significant events, such as the first anniversary of the Queen's passing. Meghan's financial troubles are also mentioned in the context of her pursuit of opportunities, even though she is reportedly in significant debt due to her husband's actions.